Okay, we're gonna. This video is for mean absolute deviation, which we also call MAD. All right, so this is just a small example, and so what I'd like to do is the first thing we have to find is the mean. All right, the mean is the average, so we want to find the mean. And to find the mean, we're gonna add up all these numbers. So four plus eight plus eight plus seven plus ten. Alright, so 8 and 8 is 16, plus 4 is 20, plus 10 is 30, so this is 37. And then to find the mean, we, we say 37, and there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 data points. So there's 1, 2, there is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 data points. So we're going to divide this by 5. And when I divide it by 5, I'm going to get 7. 7 goes, 5 goes in there 30, 7 times, that's 35. And then we're going to have 2 left over, so 2, that makes it 0.4. So that's our mean. And so um, the mean, um, usually there's a couple symbols. One is sample and one's uh, rhythmic. The rhythmic symbol is this, the population sample is a U. And so I just want to kind of give you that information there. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to um, take the mean and we're going to subtract it. So the mean minus the data points. Okay, that's each data sample or point. So I'm going to say uh, 7.4 minus 4 equals 3.4. Then I'm going to take 7.4 minus 8. And when I subtract it, I'm going to get negative 0.6. And the other one's going to be the same thing. 7.4 minus 8 is a negative 0.6. Point six. Seven point four minus seven is going to be point four, and then seven point four minus ten. If I subtract these two, I'm going to get a negative uh, two point six. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to make them all positive. So every one of these will be positive, and then we're going to add them all up again. All right, so we're going to take all these up and we're going to add them and we're going to make them all pluses. So nothing is a negative. Everything that we take the absolute value, that's where the word absolute value comes in, and we just add them all up. So that's, we're adding up, that's 10, that's 26. Decimal lineup, that's 2, 4, that's 7.76. 7, now we have to divide 7, 6. Now this is the... Uh, MAD, because we're taking the MAD now, and the MAD is our sum that we added up, and that is 7.6, and we're going to divide that by 5. So when I divide that by 5, I get 1 point, and this will be 5, 2, alright? So this right here is our MAD. And this right here is our mean. So that is our answer. And remember, MAD is the distance, is the average distance away from the mean that all our data points are. So this right here is our answer.